are tuned into School Night. I'm Novena Carvel here with Emmett Mulrooney, who just killed it on stage, holding down the guitar the whole time. And really happy that you're able to still play the guitar. Yeah, it's cool. I know. That must have been scary for you when you like woke up and your hand wasn't working. Yeah, that was it was wild. I was like, I was like, man, my hand doesn't work. Yeah, what the hell? How long did that last for? I mean, it's still kind of going on. Like, oh. I'm, at, I'm at probably like 70% back okay. to normal. So, like, usually I would love to be up there and, like, you know, do like rip a little solo, but yeah. I'm not really there yet. But it's coming back. Yeah. You know? No, I mean, I understand that's like scary as a when you use your hands. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I use them a lot. Yeah. <laughs> well, as we all do. Right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, it was sounding good. Thank you. We wouldn't have noticed. We only knew because you told us. Yeah. Um, and something else interesting that we found out about you. I mean, it said that you've been like singing before you were talking. What does that mean? I don't know. My mom like said that I, I like um, would like hum when I was like little and like try to sing a little yeah. bit before I like had my first word. And That's cute. I don't know. Yeah. It's, it's just been like always such a part of my life. Like, yeah. I got all these photos. My mom gave me this like this little envelope full of photos the other day. And it was like me with like a guitar or like sitting on a piano oh like God. at like two years old. And I was like, wow, that's cool. I'm isn't glad that, they had a camera. Yeah. And isn't that cool? Like when you see photos like that, does it make you feel like affirmed as far as yeah. what you're doing? Like, oh, I was meant Absolutely. to do this. Yeah. One thousand percent. Like it's just like this is what I'm supposed to be doing. There was never any question about it. I was like, I always knew it's this, you know? Yeah. yeah. Was were your parents playing the instruments as well? Yeah, like, my, my mom's a wonderful singer. Oh, wow. Um, I didn't get the voice from my dad. Sorry, Dan, uh, if you're watching. Dang, uh, <laughs> dad, dad slammed her on Twitch. <laughs> <laughs> but, no, he, uh, my dad played the guitar, and he was in, like, a oh, little cool. rock band. And, oh, yeah, really? Yeah. In Milwaukee? No, I, he, they, were from, they were from Minnesota. But, oh, okay, yeah. cool. Not yeah. too far away. Yeah. Um, speaking of, like, People you may know in the chat. I think you have some friends watching. I do. Um, like Rice, Rice Krispies Rice or Krispies. something. Rice Krispies. That's my boy Luke. Yeah, what's uh, up, Luke? Shout out, Luke. Yeah. <laughs> I love that. Like, isn't that nice when your friends are supporting you? They said that they're, like, so proud of you yeah, on the chat. That's so cool. Yeah. yeah. They're the best. They're the best. They were also ranting and raving about your hair, which oh. is glorious. I know it's, like, pulled back tonight. We have yeah, various looks when we have long hair. But there's a big yeah. one of me over there. It's, it has got the down and all that. Yeah, yeah. No, it's, it's great either way. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, so, okay, so Milwaukee, home of Les Paul. Yes. Les Paul guitar. Yeah. Is it, like, mandatory if you're a guitarist from Milwaukee that you play a Les Paul guitar? <laughs> I don't think it's mandatory, but it's cool. Like, um, yeah, it's actually Waukesha, which is a suburb of, of Milwaukee, okay. and that's where I grew up. And, oh. um, and, yeah, I did this project. I definitely saw Waukesha earlier, and I thought it was Waukesha. Yeah, but yeah, I don't know. It's for, all uh, these, all these. Know. Yeah, <laughs> no, but th but I did this project in in fourth grade that was like, um, like just a big project, and um, I saved up in fourth grade, and I was like, I'm gonna get a Les Paul guitar. Yeah, and um, my you, dad paid the tax like on it because I didn't. I was like, taxes. <laughs> you didn't factor that in when you were saving <laughs> no, your money. No. Did you did you want to get one because of where he was from, or just because his guitars are amazing? Because he was because it was where he was from, and like yeah. there, there's such dynamic instruments. Like you can play like anything from like a country twang to like a really heavy rock, and, mm -hmm. and that's it's just like really cool, and the humbuckers and all that. Mm -hmm. um, but they. Um, yeah, no, and and then I also got a looper pedal Ooh. for for Christmas one Ooh, year, nice. and looper pedals were also invented by Les Paul, oh. and they were called the pulverizer. And pulverizer. Yeah. Hashtag was, pulverizer. Hashtag pulverizer. Man, I want to meet someone named Paul now so I can call them pulverizer. Yeah. <laughs> I know. Me too. So you were talking about um, during quarantine, and uh, you wrote that song inspired by your dog while you were also doing homework. Yeah. Was this like high school homework, college yeah, homework? Yeah, high school. Yeah. I, ju I just graduated in January. Cool. Um, and yeah, did all those those couple years virtually, and mm. I was just in the sunroom with my dogs. That's crazy. Yeah. Are you? Shout out Maisie and Mac. Are those the dogs? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> nice. Maisie and Mac, if you're watching, much love to you. Um, are you like in your school? Were you involved in musical stuff too? As yeah. Well? I was in I was in a jazz choir and a jazz band. Mm. Yeah. 
nice. Yeah. Jazz choir, jazz band, awesome. And then more recently, you also have been like touring a little bit. You did South by Southwest. Yeah. How did that go? For Was that your first time there? Yeah, it was. I mean, first time to Texas, first time to California. It was, it's been, it's been it, wild. Right now, it's your first time to California? Yeah. Wow, cool. Yeah. Just ever, not just ever. even as a musician. Yeah, just ever. Cool. Yeah. How's, I know. how's it been going for you? It's cool. Yeah. Like, <laughs> I, you know, went to the pier and like the Santa Monica and I walked the walk of fame. Did you fame. get on the Ferris wheel? Uh, no, I didn't go on the Ferris wheel, but I should have. <laughs> I've been told. Um, but no, yeah, it's been it's been sweet. Yeah, uh, lots lots to see around here and just mm -hmm. cool views and all of it. You know? Yeah, super cool views. Yeah. Um, someone did ask a question in the chat about it was something about like, oh, what food? Ohana Kitty asked, what food in California gives you Milwaukee vibes, or is it a completely different experience in California for you? Milwaukee vibes food is like a funny thing. I mean, <laughs> I've eaten like three times while I've been here. Uh, one was a homemade a homemade meal by my oh, friend's nice. roommate. Uh, one was in and out. <laughs> we got, we landed. Classic. We said, we said, we said, uh, we want to go to in and out burger, <laughs> you know? And he's like, all right, everyone says that when they land. So we went in in and out burger. It was cool. It was just um, cool. But nothing to write home about. Uh, nothing to write home about. Oh, okay. I'm sorry. In and out. Better burgers um, in Milwaukee. Culver's. Oh my Culver's gosh. Thing, Culver's. Okay. If you're ever in Milwaukee, or I think they've got them like throughout the Midwest and stuff too, but Culver's. Yeah. Okay, dang. All right, well, we I guess we got to go to Milwaukee to like yeah. compare, um, especially you know since there's in and out slander happening right now. <laughs> um, so okay, let's talk about your music. Um, she likes my style, right? Yeah. That's the name of the song. Yeah, she likes my style. <laughs> I did make that song. Yeah, you I was, did. I was yeah. like a little thrown off for a second. Yeah. I was just reading the chat. <laughs> We can, we can do the chat if you want to. No, no, no. She likes my style. <laughs> yeah, it's a, it's a cool song. It um, is a cool song. Yeah, I'm super excited about it. It's yeah. um, yeah, it's it's about like, you know, like someone like your style, and like yeah. But it's also like about the parallels of like, I someone's liking me, throwing interest, and that means like. I'm already like good enough as it is, but it also makes you start to question every single thing about like, you know, what am I doing? Am I going out? Is my hair cool? Like, you know, oh yeah, gotta like make trying sure to I'm, maintain the style. Yeah, trying likes. to maintain the style that yeah. she likes. When realistically, you probably are maintaining it naturally. Yeah, and then if you try too hard, you might mess it up. Yeah, yeah. exactly. Is there a specific she that inspired? Uh, she likes my style. There was a she, but that she is <laughs> no longer in my life. Okay. <laughs> we're good. We're good. She's out there somewhere. Having some Culver's right now. Or yeah, with probably. Dude. <laughs> Shout out Culver's. <laughs> um, so that's gonna be like on a forthcoming album, or, or what do you think? I'm she not sure, song? honestly. Yeah. Like, I'm, I'm very just like open-ended about what I want to do with my music right now. Okay. Um, I'm independent and just really excited to be making this stuff. And and I think I've got a, something coming out in like late June. Um, mm -hmm. It's just gonna be another single, super fun, summery song. Oh, cool. Um, and I don't know. I just want to have fun. Yeah. And, like, make other people have fun with my music and stuff. You I know? love that. Yeah. I mean, you have that kind of like infectious, fun energy too. Thank you feel you. like super authentic. Appreciate it. And I can totally see you like playing festivals and yeah, stuff with the summertime about it. vibes. Hopefully. Right? Yeah. Yeah. Dope, dope, dope. Well, um, it's been so fun having you. Yeah. Here. It's been super fun. School having night here. for your first time in California. <laughs> <laughs> make sure you continue to follow Emmett Mulrooney.